Hey guys, it's Janet back with a few more tips and ideas for using the Wink of Stella brush. If you missed the first video that I did, you're going to want to check it out at remarkablycreated.com. The Wink of Stella is a new product debuting in our spring catalog, and we have the clear and the gold, and it's an amazing way to add some elements of glitter to your project. So first, I have two pieces of ribbon here just to kind of show you um, how you can make those sparkle just a little bit, and it's already dry from when I put it on because, of course, ribbon is porous, and it will just kind of soak it right up. And all you're going to do is just lay your brush tip on its side, and you're just going to add that element of glitter to your ribbon. Of course, you could also do little designs with squiggles. You can do just one fine line because that's the benefit of having that point. But just like that, you're going to have those nice pieces to work with. We also have some really nice, fine, outlined framelits in the catalog. And the Wink of Stella is going to make it really easy just to outline the top of those, just like that. Of course, you could also choose, though, to use that Wink of Stella just to fill in the insides of those. And you don't have to worry about bumping up against the actual image itself. You might want to turn it more on its point and color with the point of it. And you just want to be gentle. You don't want to be mashing down because you want to preserve the point. So that's an option for you. And you'll have to check my blog to see this really pretty finished Valentine's card that's coming with all of that Wink of Stella on it. So then another option, because it is photo safe, here's a picture, a long, long, long ago picture of my daughter, Kristen. And so I'm just going to go ahead and add just a little bit of this Wink of Stella to the snow, just kind of giving it a, a frosty look and I'll just put it in a couple of places. I'm not going to coat the whole thing, but you can see where with that, um, that technique called the bokeh technique, if you've got some lights glittering on your photos, if you've got some really pretty wintertime photos, firework photos, where that Wink of Stella is going to give just a nice little shimmer on your photos. So I'm hoping that there you go, can see that just a little bit. And then the other thing that's really nice, we've got this beautiful vellum stack coming with lots and lots of vellum. And we also currently have vellum in the catalog as well. And with this, you're going to be able to, and I would put a darker color behind it. So let me find a darker color so we can see what we're doing. And we're just going to go in and add glitter. So it's almost going to end up being like tone on tone. It'll make your images pop just a little bit. And it's just another way without adding vibrant color, just real soft. I can see this for weddings. I could see this for confirmations. Just oh, so delicate, so delicate. Just a really pretty little, really look that you're going to get. So you're going to end up with this real pretty glimmery tone on tone. Look at the look at that shimmer that that's adding to that paper. And what's really nice, give it a few seconds to dry again. It's just real soft and you don't have any raised glitter. People are going to be looking at that thinking that that's the way the paper came. And you're just going to be able to pick and choose throughout the entire project where you want your glitter to be. So again, Wink of Stella, Stella in clear and in gold. Um, make sure you check out my first video. If you don't have a complimentary spring catalog, you're going to want to get your hands on that as well too. So a couple more ideas for you. I love it when there are multiple things that you can be doing with products. I think that it really adds value to it. Have a fun day creating and crafting. God bless.